Hey, what's going on, guys? Um, so today I'm actually filming this super fast, as fast as possible, uh, first makeup tutorial. I am actually, um, I really wanted to do the alien palette. The reason why I wanted to do it was because it literally, um, whoever ordered it with two-day shipping probably got it today. I tried to film this before work, but I had to leave for work as it was arriving. So that was a whole thing. So right now I'm trying to film as fast as I can. I uh, I don't think anyone's done this. I haven't really looked into it, but I actually am going to... Oh, let me show you. What am I doing? No, but I want to do a challenge where it's... um, What's it called? I do every eyeshadow in here on my eye. So it's like an every eyeshadow challenge. I'll put it right somewhere. Right there. And then, yeah, just tag me in it, and then I'll go like your stuff and whatnot. You know, shout out for a shout out. But yeah, dude, so literally, I don't want to say the only reason, but the majority of why I want to get this palette was this color Probe. And then Probe, X-Files, and Alien. Those are like the sickest ever. Um, so yeah, right now, I don't have anything on my eye except like highlighter that I was wearing throughout the day. But I'm actually going to prime with, um, where'd it go? <gasps> So, the reason I'm trying to hurry up is because currently it is um, 6.21. Can you see that? Yeah. 6.21 and what's it called? Um, I'm headed out to California at 3 in the morning tomorrow. So, I'm going to spend the night at my manager's house. We're going to head over and then, yeah, it's okay. So, I got a little bit. So I'm just trying to get this out. The reason I'm trying to get this out so fast is because obviously no one has it yet, you know? So like right now it's kind of, um, what is it? Everyone's trying to like see how the palette works and whatnot. The only other video that, well, I haven't seen it yet, but um, I saw that another guy, what's it called? He did the alien thing too, but I'm trying to get mine as fast as I can because obviously if you release your video first, you have the upper hand, you know? And I've not seen anyone review it yet, so I'm just trying to get this as fast as I can, and then, yeah, we'll go on from there. So I literally have, like, a million Morphe eyeshadow brushes that I've not used. I've currently purchased the James Charles palette, so I will be doing a look on that, too. <gasps> and then, um, uh, yeah, so I ordered the brushes and the palette. I'm so mad. I should have gone to the store to get it because people literally have it already, but whatever. No one, I've never seen anyone film this, so I'm going to do this one. So, uh, Anna, it's going to be like a, a mukbang kind of thing, you know? Mukbang, that's a weird word. Okay, so, uh, other than the packaging, I thought I would hate this thing, but dude, it's so cool. I was like, oh, why is it pink? But I guess that's this whole study, but I really like it now. So, there's that. Uh, you got to be careful, though, because if you touch it with, like, um, eyeshadow on your finger, it is going to get dirty. I did it right there, if you guys can see. So, there's that. Be very careful. Um, yeah, so... I am going to go into, I'm going to be going into, I can't function right now. Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to go into the Titan shade right now. I am going to, no, yeah, okay. I'm going to blend gravity into my crease and see how that works out. Oh gosh, what, what is this? This video is going to be like half of me trying to open these freaking... Oh, you know what? I have scissors. Okay. So, I'll just open as I go. Uh, this first brush I'm going to be using is the uh, M537. Okay. Is that right? Yeah. Whatever. Okay. So, I'm going to be going into... What is it? The Gravity. That literally looks like my skin color. Wow. Okay. And then I'm just going to be going into the... I think it's gonna work. Uh, I've never done this before, so I'll just let's go. Okay, we got that. Oh, this brush is kind of like pokey, actually. Poke my eyeball. Um, weird. So right now I have like a ring light right here, but I'm gonna use like the ultra close one. Should I do it over here? I should do it behind the camera. That way, it's like. Does that make sense? No. I can't see shit. Okay. Abort mission. 
we're going here, I'm moving this here, we're going that there, and yeah, okay, so that one, yeah, dude, this is literally, honestly, like, the color of my eye, hmm, okay, one down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, wait, twelve, uh, fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, Heart stop. Sorry, that's my cat. Uh, one, two, three, four, sixteen. There's eighteen shades in here, so I have seventeen more to go. So I went with that, and then now I'm gonna go in with Martian soil. I'm actually gonna put Martian soil right here as a. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna put Martian soil in this area right here. I'm gonna go with the same brush because why not? So, uh, I'm gonna go into that. And then, um, this is so awkward. How do people do this? Um, I'm just gonna put that on the outer area thing. What is it? What do they call it? The outer V. And then I'm just gonna push that into the crease. Um, yeah, bam, bam. And I'm gonna. Blend it all the way to the inner corner. Just like that. Okay. Cool, cool. Oh, you kind of see that, huh? Well, I need to be more like that. But it's kind of hard to see on camera because I'm using all these like basic neutral shades. Okay, now that we've gone in with that and pushed that into to create a little bit of depth. Ooh. I don't even know how I'm going to do this. Okay. So we got gravity, we have Martian soil, we have home. Mm. Oh, you know what I want to do actually? Okay, so um, for some reason I like when like guys have like, they look tired for some reason. So like the bottom of their eye is kind of like gray. So that is actually what I'm going to do. I'm going to go into uh, X-Files. Dude, I love this little alien like print. And then... Oh, damn, I should have went in a smaller brush. Oh, well, there's no going back, guys. So I'm actually going to put this. Uh, so you know how uh, when you're doing your inner corner, you usually go with a height, like a lighter shade? I'm actually going to try to pack this into the inner corner and then kind of blend it outward. So I'm going to blend it under my lash line. And then I'm just going to pull whatever color is left on the brush as far as it can go. So it's going to be darker here, and then it's going to pull out over here. It's all going to come together, guys. Watch. So, dang it. I feel like, dang, I should have done this side, huh? That would have made more sense. Okay. I'm going to move this light over here so you guys can actually see. Um. Uh, okay, yeah, you guys can see, right? Um, so yeah, I went into X Files. I'm gonna keep dragging that. I really want it like in this inner corner, so make it as gray as you can. You wanna look real tired, real, real tired. Just like that. Now that I got that kind of blended. Um, uh, I'm going to go into phone home. Where the hell is it? Bam. I'm going to go in with a, I'm going to be smart and actually go in with a shader brush for like your under, under your eye. Um, uh, what brush will be good for that? Um, well, it's too late for that now. Um, um. Uh, I'm going to go in with um, E18, slice that little sucker open. Dude, imagine if I like cut it and then I cut off the little hairs. I'll be mad as hell. Okay. We got that going. Gotta hurry, gotta hurry. What time is it? 29? Okay, I got time. Oh, cool. Yeah, I think this would be a good color or a good brush. Mmm. Okay. So I'm going to be going into phone home, which is kind of like a, it's like, you know when someone leaves like a hickey on your neck? That's, it's 
Did you see that? Oh no. All right, that's part of the look now, guys. It's gonna be a uh, alien. Okay, so I don't know what's going on. I tapped it here by accident and I tapped it here by accident, so we're just gonna go with it. So uh, if I'm not stupid, I'm gonna blend this. What the hell did I even put it there? We're gonna blend this from out here downwards and I'm going to try to go as to the middle as possible and then what I'm going to what I'm going to want to do is blend this upwards since I'm already doing something like that for no reason but you know how like people connect their bot their top to like their wing thing I'm going to do it from here to up here and split it out and then since we have that tier I'm just going to pull it down and do something else with it later. So we're gonna blend, and I'm gonna create something. I'm gonna create like a sharp line, you know. So back in with phone home, pack it right under, and then pull it straight down. This is not like a crazy color. It's just gonna be a color where you look kind of like used, abused, you know. Get it back on, pull it down, stretch it out. It's gonna be the sickest look of all time. Look at that shit. Oh, that looks kind of weird, huh? Huh, I like it. So, pack it on, pull it down, stretch it out. It's like a double alien color, you know? Pack it on, pull it down. Okay. Ooh, that's starting to look pretty sick. Okay, I'm gonna pack it on here. And then blend it out. I actually want to create a really sharp line. So what I'm going to do is going to this, um, it just says an eyeliner brush from, what's that brand with like the SK, the Target one? You know what I'm talking about. Just look up, and I'm going to go in with uh, Phone Home as well. But I actually want to create like a sharp line. Kind of like a wing, but like under your eye. I'm gonna go like this. That looks sick. Okay. And then pull it out. Stretch it out. Um, this is a looking. Oh my god. Disaster. Oh, you know what? Should I use? Ooh. I'm gonna go in with this um what is it it's like a little angled eye brush for your eye but I'm gonna go I know it's not elf it's my well but I'm gonna kind of just pull it ever so slightly wow I can just cut it with a concealer later my stupid ass okay um go in there down I'll go in with like darker shader, dark, ugh, darker shades later, and then um, we'll see what happens. But to create like depth and stuff, we'll see. Okay, that's good enough. This is just an outline, guys. Don't judge me yet. And then what else? Boom, 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 boom. I want to go with all the. Ooh, look at this green shade. I don't really want to go into that. Oh, uh, where am I gonna put it? Got it. So you know when you um when you're what's it called when you put anything white under here, um it kind of opens up your eye so it makes it look a little bit bigger and doll like that than what it really is with your sad disgusting eyes. So I'm gonna go in with abduct and then push that right under. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh my god, did I just touch my eye? Hold on. So we're going into abduction and pushing that shit right in there. Yep. Dude, this shit's gonna look sick as hell. Okay. So 
I mean, this is the first time I've ever done like a tutorial, but or like any kind of eyeshadow look. But everything that I see with people with like weirder colors is that you should like pack it in and then kind of like blend it out towards the end. Don't go in like blending immediately because then it's did it just go away? Because then it's just going to go away. So I'm just going to pack it on. Damn, hell yeah. Fucking alien vibes. Hmm, should I like yank it down? I think that's what I'm going to do. Okay, so pack that on. Okay, so we have that on. And then I'm just going to... I'm going to flip over the brush that I'm using and then kind of blend out. So like the green and then like that blood red color kind of like kind of mix in together on their own. Okay, now that we went in with that, um, I think I want to go in. Oh, I would even show you guys what color. I'm going to do, um, so I did abduction right here. You can see it better in the light, which like boom. And then I'm going to go in with Titan, which is like a, what is it? Like a dirty white. Um, and then I'm actually going to put that on my brow bone with who knows what brush. I want to use this one, but I think there's like black on it. Should we try it on this side? I'm not going to do this eye, so if black appears, we're not going to use it. Yep, that's not going to work. Um, let's see here. Let's try, I think you need, oh, I know. Um, there's a little black one that I use for my eyebrow bone, but I don't know where it's at. Where's the stupid brush? Okay, we're gonna go in with... What is this? M506. It looks like a good size, so I'm just gonna do that real quick. Ooh, it smells kind of weird. Oh, I think my eyes are kind of burning, actually. So self note, don't put uh, products in your eye or else they it will kind of burn. Okay, so I'm going to go in with the Titan shade, which is like the dirty white. And then I'm going to put that, I mean, I don't have a defined, but I'm just going to put it all on the top. So. And then. Dude, that's kind of cool, actually. I didn't realize how bright it was going to make, like, wherever I put it. So I'm just going to yank that. So, I mean, I didn't plan to do this, but it kind of looks like it's separating the eyeshadow color from my actual, like, skin. So, and it, like, do you see that difference between, like, here and then, like, my eyebrow? So that's pretty cool. Hmm. So we'll try that. And then, um, mm, what else? What else do we need? I want to go in with all the matte shades first. Oh, there you go. Da, 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 da. I went with X Files. Ooh, okay. Now it's time to do Flying Saucer. It's this cool, like, um, dark green. Uh, I'm going to go in. I think I found a little smudging brush. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is a smudger brush. Oh, I should have been reading these. Mm, oh well. Okay, this is a M213. Um, I do not have a code with Morphe, but I think I should. So you should definitely go message them and tell them to give me a code. So I'm going to go in with this little smudger brush, and then I'm going to go right as close as I can to the lash line. And then, oh my god, dude, this, do you see that? Oh my god, I actually have it in my eye. Oh, I went away. Hmm. Okay, so I'm just going to put that right in my eye. So it's kind of like creating an eyeliner effect. And I'm actually not going to try to blend it out. I just want to like put it in. So what's cool is like when you're playing with color is that just go in with a lighter or a darker version of what you went into and it just starts looking better. That's what I've noticed when like watching all these videos and stuff. 
Oh, dude, this is kind of sick. It's actually covering all my bottom lashes with, like, green. Oh, that is super cool, actually. Oh, yeah, and I'm actually going to be doing a Grinch tutorial, too, so. If you guys are down with that, let me know. I'm going to do it regardless, so. Yeah. Dude, that is so cool. This is literally covering my eyelashes. Hmm. Oh, wow, I can't see shit. Okay, so. We're gonna go with green. Oh, dude, that's pretty cool. So since this does have, like, greens and kind of, like, purple. Greens and kind of, like, one reddish. You could kind of do, like, a Christmas look with this, too. We're gonna do that. And blend it out. I know I said I wasn't gonna blend, but oh, well. I want a lot more hair than this. So I'm actually going to be trying something new because something that I realized is that like, you know how people are like kind of dishonest for like the color and like what's in it and whatnot. I'm actually not going to be editing this video so you guys can see like how long it actually takes me and how long it's like, like I have to keep putting in like product, you know, and if it like works, it works. But please keep in mind that this is my first palette, and I have no idea what I'm doing, so. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I'm actually kind of hungry. So, I went to Smash Burger because I'm getting, like, a free burger every day. And, dude, their Arizona burgers are so good. So, I'm just going to take a real bite. Dude, what if the sauce fell in my palette? Oh, no. Um, okay. Mother flipper. Some avocado just fell on my, on my, um, my ring light. Okay, yep. Yeah. Okay. Um. Holy shit, that's spicy. Okay. The show must go on. Um, okay, so I did dark green, light green, I did that, and then I did the two colors on the top. What is next here? Ooh, that crazy purple shade that he did. Mm. Oh, that's going to be sick as hell. Okay. So what I think I'm going to do is go in with, um, what did I go in with before? What is this? Huh? I think that's too big, actually. So what I want to do with the purple, right, is, um, well, this will be good, but... I want to do it like in this outer V section so it's like like it looks cool when it's like sunk in over here even though my whole eye is going to look sunk in by the end of this video so that's what we do here okay something smells like paint hmm I don't know if this is just me but if you like smell the area 51 color it kind of smells like paint okay ready I'm scared. I'm gonna like bend my neck, look up. Come on, seems to be showing up, and then I want to look up and then push that away. And so I'm gonna, oh yeah, okay, and then I'm gonna. Pull very slightly and then push that in my crease area and then yeah. So I keep hearing that purples are like crazy to make and whatnot. So I'm just gonna play it safe and just push that in first and then I'm gonna get a blending brush later and just blend all that shit out. So go like that. Pack it in, see, and then cool. And then I'll blend this out later. I know it looks like a disaster, guys, but dude, look how cool my eye looks. It looks like it's like sunk. Like, what if I did this like dark too? So it's like just double sunk. So many good ideas, guys. And I'm still hungry. Hold on, I gotta take another bite. Um. 
Um, I'm gonna be posting this picture when I'm done on Instagram too. So definitely go look at it because I'm just gonna wash it off as soon as I'm done. Okay. Okay. Purple is done. Now I'm going to go in with tall gray, which is like the coolest gray blue I've ever seen. I've literally seen none, but oh, I was hearing like a weird noise coming from the laundry room and it was just my cat. So because that is a lighter shade, um, Oh, okay, I know what I'm going to do. So, I'm going to use that smudger brush that I used um, for the <clears throat> lower lash line and just brush away whatever green I have left over. Um, just on the back of my hand, so all the pigment is gone. Okay, no more pigment. I erased it all. And then I'm going to go in with tall gray, and I'm going to kind of define these, like, sharp lines and see if that works. Oh, my God. That literally got it so good. So, I'm going to do the same thing I did last time. Oops. Push it in, and then sharpen it, so. Hmm. I might go in with, like, an eyeliner that I got at Walmart for Halloween and then just kind of make it extra sharp because I don't think these eyeshadows are going to make it as sharp as I want it to, you know? Or maybe if I just got a different brush, but no. Oh, dude, that's actually looking kind of cool. Pack it on. So I was thinking about doing like giveaways on here. I know I, I literally have like 30 subscribers, but I mean, you guys are, you guys are going to be like the OGs, you know? You guys going to follow me through my life mission. So, I mean, if you guys want something like specific that's kind of crazy expensive, definitely let me know. And if a lot of people ask for it, I'll probably give it away. But a lot of people have to be asking for it. I'm not just going to get it for a selfish ass. Dude, that color is really cool. When I like going with my brush, it like, it kind of makes it look like it's like buttery. I didn't touch that one shade because I didn't want it to like, um, what is it? Oh my gosh, man. I didn't want it to get, um, what is it? Like, the oils on my fingers, I didn't want it to ruin the thing. So, I'm just going to take this and bring that. Hell yeah, dude, that shit looks sick as hell. Okay. Okay, cool. So I have that done. I have the kind of wing thing going on. Okay. Now, ooh, there is like a black shade. And I heard blacks are going to be crazy. So what I probably am going to do is connect barely. Okay. Barely any black here. And like slowly blend it out. Hmm. So, I don't even want to, like, put any of the brushes in there because I feel like they're going to get really dirty. Um, oh, some of these brushes already have black. Wow. Thanks, Halloween, Eric. Yeah, so this one has, like, a black from an old palette. Dude, when a black goes on your brush, it goes on forever. It will never come off, like...
Look, you see all those freaking black? So I'm going to go on the shade Black Hole. That's scary. And I'm just going to put it on the back of my hand so you can see. Oh, holy shit. Yeah, it's going to be... So I'm just going to brush away the extra just to create like a darkening shade. And then put... Look up. Put that right there. Pat it in. Bring it down. And then pull it ever so slightly. I don't want it to go half my eye. So, but hold down to the purple and keep it there. Okay. So now that we got that black going on, I'm not gonna pull it all the way in because I don't want to look crazy, and then. Now it's time to play with the shiny ones. There is a shade called Pluto in here, and it kind of looks like a shiny white, but it looks like there's something pink in there. So I'm, of course, be basic and put that into my inner corner. <laughs> I'm going to go in with this. Um, I really like this brush for the inner corner. It's the E37. It's probably made for me, Eric. Uh, and I'm going to... So I'm going to do right in the center and then pull it. Huh. I don't see nothing. And then, oh, I heard it be like spray with shiny. It's gonna like make it stick better. That's okay for now. So do you see that? Oh yeah, it actually looks really good on camera actually. Who would have thunk? Oh, so I guess this is like a, I was about to say flavor. It's a shade that you have to kind of like pack on. And I'm gonna kind of bring that down and then under. Okay, cool. Yeah, let me turn on my flash. Um, let's see. So it's kind of hard. See, it looks like a cool. Wait. Oh yeah, you see that? Cool, cool. All right, time for the next shimmer. Alien. Oh hell yeah. Okay. So I am currently obsessed with all these crazy highlighter shades. Um. The weirder, the better for me. So I think I'm actually going to apply that here to create dimension in that weird shape that I did. So I'm going to be going into, I'm going to be going in with a brush. Uh, and then go into shade Alien. Holy God, that, that's big right there. Got to be extra careful. bring it down and then put it right down here kind of like a setting powder but not you know whoa dude that's crazy oh that looks so cool look at that shit who needs a setting powder when you have a shimmer so yeah, just pat that in. So it's like an inner corner, but like a super inner corner. And then I'm gonna go in with a smaller, I need a smaller highlighting brush. Um, uh, what is good? I'll probably try to go in, what is this? I think it's a synthetic Morphe M224 brush. And I'm gonna go in with the same alien shade. And then, why did I go for this brush? I'm trying to like create like a sharp line here. Wow. Okay. Cool.
dude, that looks so dope. Okay. So abort mission. I'm just gonna cut everything with this shaman shade, and then just pull it and blend it out. Okay. And then, now that we got that one, the next shade is gonna be moon rock. It looks like this like black gold kind of color. Um, pretty snazzy, huh? So I'm gonna go in with this color. Um. Where'd it go? Moon. Oh, wait. I didn't even go. Oh, wait. I'm forgetting all these shades. We got one, two, three, four, six. Okay, six more shades to go. I am going to go with Interstellar and. I can't believe this. Oh, I'll create like a. Um, so it's like that wing I was doing, but like not. Does that make sense? I'll go like down here. Oh, that was a mistake. Yeah, so it's kind of like a glitter wing, whatever. Yeah. That's a thing, right? So I'm just going to pack that there. And then... Now that that one's out of the way, I'm going to go into UFO, which is like a green gold. And I'm. That one is pretty cool. Not the not the the moon rock one, but this one looks so snazzy. So I'm gonna go in with this shade. And what am I gonna do with this? Probably put it on the, the brown bone. I think that was the wrong choice, actually. Oh my god, I forgot there's purple on here. Okay. Wait, what? I didn't even go into UFO. Oh my god. So I'm gonna go into to UFO. And then hit right. Oh, hell yeah. Do you know what shade this kind of reminds me of? Um, from his, what is it? His, his like highlighter shades, the so fucking gold one. That kind of reminds me of. So I'm gonna create, um, kind of like a ring above my eye using this gold, and I'm gonna take it all the way into the brow. But it's kind of cool. So since I did use this brush to like go into a purple, it like kind of creates like a dark effect when you like look away. Oh, what if this is like a third wing? I love him. Okay. And then I'm going to sharpen that out using the M224 again. But I have to go back into the UFO shade and then kind of like stretch that out. And I'll create like sharper lines to define it the more I go in. So I'm going to go back into the uh, M506, what time is it? Guys, I have to hurry! And then pack that on, blend it up. Ooh, I'm gonna kinda like trap my eyebrow in the gold. Pull it up. And then, I want this shit like covered. Ooh, should I like bring it down too? I'll bring it down. I don't even want it to look like my eye. Like, I want it to look like some crazy ass shit. Okay. So now that I got the gold ready to go, bring this hair down a little bit. Wow. Dude, that's super cool. And then uh, I'm going to go into Moon Rock. I still have three more shades to go into. Moon Rock is gonna go. Oh, I know where Moon Rock is gonna go, guys. So I'm gonna go into my smudger brush again and then go into Moon Rock. And because I am trying to create that like dark look under my eye, I kind of erased it all with all the. Oh, 
what is it with all the with all that you know that one in the bottom so i'm gonna go in with this like black gold and then uh, i don't know if that's working it's kind of like a it kind of looks like glitter or not glitter like um gold flakes This stuff has to be like eye safe, right? Because I keep getting it in my eye. Mm. So we go with that. And pull it to this. So now that we got that going on, I am going to use Space Cowboy, which is like the coolest looking shade ever. And I want to go into like um like right in my inner corner, but it's gonna create like darkness into it. But I can't seem to find my oh here it is. So I usually use that M three two one brush for like my inner corner. I don't know why it usually like fits better to like put it there and then put it down. So I'm gonna go into Space Cowboy. It's like a black red. It looks really cool. Um. Oh, my eye's like really itchy, but I can't scratch it. Uh, I think I'm going to go in with a different brush. Let me see. No. Okay, now it's working. So, push that in there. Oh, so it kind of looks like, um, what's that called? Oh, there it is. So at first I was trying to like pack it on, but it wasn't really working. But then as soon as you like start swiping it, shit, the color comes out. Cool. So now we have that going in and then I'm going to use um, Probe. Probe is probably my favorite color out of this palette. Um, where's your Probe? Oh, I'll put Probe like, um... What is that thing called when you like, oh shit, what is it called? You know what it's called? Um, it's like when you do that like halo. I think I want to do that. Okay, so I'm actually going to go in back in with a matte shade. Yeah, I know. And then I'm actually going to get the Martian soil because it is like a brighter yellow. And then kind of just like, I want to tap this in. I don't know why I got a blender brush. I need a packer brush. Um, just gonna pack a brush. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with what is this? Morphe E18. I'm gonna go in with Martian soil, and then throw that right in the crease. So what I'm gonna do is like create like a seamless thing as soon as I cover it with concealer. So, um, the probe color kind of just blends in like really nicely. Is it just me, but I'm like, I like actually want to see like more makeup tutorials. I feel like people don't do that anymore, you know? So I'm going to blend that in and then bring it down. That looks real good. Um, what else? I want to do like a really, oh, you know what I'll do? I'll get the, um, the Jeffree Star. Oh no, I gave that to a friend. Uh, okay. So what I'm going to do is do like um a halo eye. I mean, I've never done it before, but I've seen people do it and it shouldn't be that hard, right? Uh, do, 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 do. What is it? I'm going to go in with the M. 224. It's like the one that I've been using for glitter. I've seen people use this. They're like, oh my gosh, it's a MAC synthetic brush to cut the crease. And I'm like, okay. Uh, so I'll just do that right here. And then if you like look up and you bring it down, it should kind of like create like where you need to put it. So look up and like down. Um, uh, what does that look like? 
more now. Click it up and like that. Like, why is this so scary? How do people do this? Oh no. Oh, that's scary. Oh, and then people like said it. I see. Oh, I see now. Okay, so I'm gonna switch that in. Blend it out. Do 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 do. This should actually be that big, but you gotta do what you gotta do, you know. And then we're gonna set that with Titan. So I'm gonna go with um the Titan shade and just like put that in to like set it, you know. Oh god, it's going everywhere. How do people do this? No nope, disaster. I don't know what's going on. This is spreading. Um, do you guys see that? Like right here, it like spread. How do? I don't know if you'll be able to see it. Maybe I can cover it so no one can see. I mean, no one's gonna see this. I'm gonna Photoshop this anyways. But it's all for the glamour. This one, like, this is, I don't understand how people, like, put it so it, like, comes out dry. Like, I'm, like, putting a bunch of powder on there, but it's, like, not setting, you know? Like, it's still kind of sticky. Okay, so now it's set. And I'm going to, uh, I'm going to get this brush again, but I'm going to wipe off all the concealers that I used onto the back of my hand um so i can like go and use it for um what is it so i can i'm gonna use like a setting spray and then kind of set set my brush i'm gonna spray this i don't know if this will oh no Ugh. whatever i'm gonna go into the uh Oh, there's so many numbers. How do people do this? This is uh, number 321, and I'm going to go into the shade Probe. Oh, that's nice. It, like, really came off. And I'm just going to put that in. Oh, dude, that's super cool. Hot damn. Yup. I feel like I need a sharper brush to like make this look nicer, you know? Oh, oh it's on my eye. Oh. Wow, I'm like a pro over here. I love how I use like mattes under and then I put shimmers just to cover everything up. I love that. Yeah, this shit's cool. It's like green, purple. It's green, red, and like blue. Okay, so we got that and then I'll blend that out. And then I'm gonna go in with the smudger brush and then kind of just Define this line with the black hole. I hope for the best.
Okay, and then I'm going to... Uh, I'm just going to go into black hole and kind of just darken the line. That way, when I like blend it in, it just looks kind of like super nice. Now. So, line, line. Um, yeah see so this black and then the tall gray it kind of just like creates like its own blend on its own and then yeah um guys i think i use every shade in this palette to create this beautiful eye look Cool, so where are you guys? So let me use my flash. A better picture is gonna be on Instagram because I literally almost have to go. Yeah, dude, I have to leave in like um like 10 minutes. So I'm gonna go wash this off, pack up, and then freaking head out. Um yeah, I will be doing like a Dude, this was already difficult using like how many shades? One, two, three, four. I literally used 18 shades for this. And like I thought it was gonna be so easy. And then I'm over here like thinking that I should do the 39 palette with all the shades. Maybe I'll do like half the color on this eye and then half the color on this eye. Cause dude, this was crazy. Like I couldn't even like like it was so much to like deal with. Um, I'm just gonna add a little bit more of the UFO. I wish UFO the was like, oh, did I put UFO here? I'm pretty sure I did. I wish UFO had like um, what is it? No, I wish this palette had like a silver, silver. You know, that looks so cool. Go that way. Oh, maybe I should blend it out a little bit more. That way it looks cooler in the photo. So I'm gonna go into the the blending brush, what? blending crease with the SK brand, and then see what happens. Something that I see people do is like they push too hard on their brush, which then I think does nothing because like you're literally like the end of the bristles are not even touching your like eyeshadow, you know. Oh, dude, it kind of is blending, actually. Tell me why I thought it wasn't going to blend. Um, what is it? Blend until your knuckles bleed? I think that's the one my friend told me. So. Oh, I, I really want the inner corner to really pop with the, the cowboy shade. So I'm going to put more in there. Yeah. It's like a dirty blood black red. Like, you know when you, like, kill a goat and you're, like, about to summon Satan? This is, like, the color that, like, comes out of the goat. So, in case anyone was wondering. Uh, yeah. I want to I add some purple in there. I'm going to go with a little smudger brush. I'm going to go back into Area 51. And then put that right. Oh. Oh, can I put it in my lash line? Oh, I should go with a wider color in my lash line. What if I blend it in my lash line, actually? So I'll go with purple first. It's literally just looking black. Wow. 
Hell yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna go in with shade. Um. Titan, but I wanna go in with. I don't wanna put glitter in my eye. Oh, I'll do this. What is this? This is a Morphe four three two. I wonder how they like came up with their names for this. Oh, dude, look how black, and then you like turn. It's like bam. I wonder how they came up with the names for these freaking brushes. They don't make any sense to me. At first, I thought they got their name from um, like how many like bristles there were in the brush, but honestly, I don't know anymore. Okay, so what's it gonna be? Titan. Um, on my little lash. I feel like this is gonna kind of hurt. Oh my god, that's what you can do. You can, like, get the alien sh No, not alien. Get the titan shade. And if you, like... You can coat your eyelashes with it. Something that I heard from, like, the Mario guy was that, like, if you, um... If you're able to... If you add, like, any white powder to, like, any part of your, like, hair... It kind of emphasizes the texture, so I think that's what I'm going to do. Because that's going to look real freaky. Dude, you can't even see me. I wonder if you can't even see me for like the whole video. I'm still going to post it though. It makes me look like I have, like, blurry vision. Dude, that is so freaky. All right, well, thank you guys. Uh, I appreciate you guys staying here and watching this, even though half of you probably couldn't even see me doing my face. But I used all 18 shades in this palette. Um, I think it was very good. Um, I definitely have a long way to go, but you live and you learn, you know? But, uh... Yeah, it's going to be a super fun challenge. Hopefully, you guys make it viral, and then everyone starts doing it, and it's, like, because of me, you know? And then I become rich and famous. This is kind of like a... Why does it remind me of that, like, David Bowie guy? He had, like, the lightning on his face. It kind of reminds me of that. But, yeah, guys, uh, this is the finished look. I will be taking a picture and posting on my IG, so definitely follow on my IG because I, um, I want more people on my IG. Um, my Snapchat, and then all my other stuff is going to be down below. If you do want to work with me, though, um, hit me up on my business email. I will be doing... I'm just kidding. I don't know what I'm going to be doing. But, yeah. Cool, guys. Uh, let me do one final look at it. And then I will actually see you guys for the next video. All right? See you guys.